how much money do you think the candidates contesting the Lok Sabha polls have in their bank accounts? Or do you know which politician is a millionaire and who does not even own a car or is living in a rented apartment? Well, the affidavit submitted by the candidates to the Election Commission of India along with their nomination papers in Assam have revealed that the state has some millionaire candidates contesting the elections. Union Minister of Ports, Shipping and Waterways Sarbananda Sonwal, who is contesting the elections from Debrugar Lok Sabha seat, has declared that he has rupees 28,000 cash in hand. Apart from that, Apart from the cash in hand, Sonwal also has Rs 48 lakh in four different bank accounts, the election affidavit revealed. The affidavit also revealed that the former Assam chief minister also has a loan of Rs 16 lakh against his name. It also mentioned that he does not own a car and has immovable assets worth Rs 1.65 crore. Meanwhile, affidavit submitted by Bharatiya Janata Party's Lakhimpur candidate Pradhan Borwa revealed that he has rupees 38 lakh in three different bank accounts. He also has immovable assets worth rupees 70 lakh, the affidavit revealed. It also revealed that Borwa's wife has a residential complex in her name in Guwahati, apart from having loan of rupees 22 lakh against her name. Meanwhile, the election affidavit submitted by Assam Jatiya Parishad Lurin Jyoti Gogoi revealed that he has cash rupees 10 lakh and jewellery worth rupees 90,000. The value of Lurin's immovable assets is rupees 25 lakh, while he has a loan of rupees 5,000 against his name, the affidavit revealed. Though he does not own a house, the AGP president and party's Debrugger candidate has farmland worth rupees 9 lakh to his name. Meanwhile, Congress's Sonitpur candidate Prem Lal Ganju has two police cases registered against him, the election affidavit revealed. He also has cash of rupees 1 lakh with him. Congress candidate from Karim Ganj, Roslina Tirki, in her election affidavit revealed that she has assets worth Rs 45 lakh to her name. It may be mentioned here that today is the last day to file nomination for the first phase of Lok Sabha polls scheduled for 19th of April.